The Benex extraction system has an additional device for special extraction situations. The Benex stick remover. It is for situations where the Benex extractor can't be positioned. The roots must be loosened very well, more than for the Benex extractor. As in the following situations. Inaccessible and loosened root tips. Palatinal molar roots. Mesiodens. Horizontally impacted teeth. A clinical case. The first molar must be removed due to endodontic problems. Good. Following anesthesia, a proximal slicing is necessary for intra-alveolar luxation, which must be done immediately after anesthesia, because the periodontal fibers will continue loosening with time. Luxation in a distomesial direction ensures that there is absolutely no force on the buccal wall. Slight rotation with the forceps will additionally loosen the periodontal fibers. The crown is then separated and removed. The palatinal root is separated from the buccal roots. The luxator is used to make sure the palatinal root is completely separated and to loosen the root thoroughly in a mesiodistal direction. Clearing the canal has two advantages. On the one hand, the root axis is made visible and on the other hand, the diamond will not get smeared. An in and out motion is used with the Benex burr for better rinsing of the canal. Fix the screw in the stick remover. Insert the screw. Tap gently until the periodontal fibers give way. It is essential to remove the palatinal root first in order to be able to luxate the buccal roots in the distopalatinal and mesiopalatinal direction. The post-extraction situation shows the ideal preservation of soft and hard tissue. More information can be found at benexdent.com. Important! Please visit website before use.